I'm having a little read um, of my favourite subject, which is of course maths. Um, and I just wanted to say we're missing you so much and hopefully we'll see you in school soon when you come and meet your new teachers. And I just want to give you the message that some of you may be getting a bit fed up with home learning and the message is that if you do nothing else at home, can you please make sure that you read every single day. And I've been using as a bookmark this, um, this quote that I found and I've been thinking about this in lockdown. So it says, reading gives us some place to go when we have to stay where we are. And I've been doing loads of reading during lockdown to help me. Okay, so I'm gonna go and find Mr. Cross in a minute and we're going to show you a presentation. I'm just gonna read the statistics page first and then we'll go and find Mr. Cross. Okay, uh, Mr. Dunn, I'm just gonna get back to my reading, okay? No more. Let's get him ready. Where's that Mr. Cross? Can't find him anywhere. <laughs> Wait a minute. You okay there, Mr. Cross? Yes, thanks, Mrs. No, I'm just on my lunch break, enjoying Oliver Twist. Mm, okay. Teddy okay? Yeah, he's, a, he's looking, all well. Looking after him? <laughs> I'm telling him a story. Oh. <laughs> you enjoy yourself, but could you join me for a presentation? Can I just finish this page? I guess so. Thanks. See you in a minute. See you in a minute. Welcome to the assembly, but not assembly, assembly. Reading presentation. Assembly. presentation. Okay. It's all about reading. It's all about reading. Reading helps you with everything. So why is it so important? I love this quote here. The more you read, the more you know, and the more you know, the smarter you grow. Okay. And this is so true as well. Reading is dreaming with open eyes. You can escape anywhere. At the moment, we're all stuck indoors. We can't go anywhere. But by opening a book, you can travel anywhere you like. There are lots of reasons why we want you to read as often as you can. It improves your vocabulary. The words that you know grow all the time through reading. Your spelling improves. It gives us knowledge. You can learn so much about the world, other cultures, everything. You can find books about anything. Gives us a deeper understanding of cultures, cultures, traditions, and the world. It's calming. If you're feeling a bit stressed or you can't sleep, not that stress. It calms you and it actually aids with sleeping. It improves the imagination. Like I said, you can go off anywhere you like. Helps you to access every area of the curriculum. If you can read well, you can read about other subjects. So if you're reading about a history topic. It's going to help you because you can already access that difficult reading text. Develops logic, reasoning and inquisitiveness and it improves your concentration, means you can think for longer. Okay, how often should you be reading? Well, just try and do a little bit every day. However, 30 minutes would be really great if you could do 30 minutes of reading, but let's be, let's be practical and say any reading at all, every day would be amazing. And like I said earlier, if you're getting a bit fed up with um, home learning and struggling a little bit, if you do nothing else, then please, 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 please. Should we beg? Should we beg? Please, please, please do regular reading. But if you find a book that you love, yeah, just you'll hours. get lost, you'll spend hours. hours and hours and hours. You won't want to put it down. Um, make sure, it goes without saying, but just try really hard. Get that book that you know you're going to really enjoy, the genre that you're going to enjoy. Where can you read? Anywhere. Absolutely anywhere. And if you want to show um, us photos, send them to support at kingston.essex.co.uk of places where you've been doing your reading. Um, On the side of the cliff? No, thanks. No, no. thanks, Mr. Cross. Oh, no, host? no, uh, no, thanks. That's fine. Maybe in a day. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll okay. do that with my granddaughter. Okay. You have access to so many resources. Not only books, but you have the Oxford Reading Buddy, which you can log on to, the Accelerated Reader to complete any quizzes about books that you have read, the Oxford Reading Hour, Scholastic Reading Pro, 
and there's lots of links your teachers have sent you to books online, audio books and fun activities around all different reading and different books. We have sent, we're sending out a letter to all your parents letting you know how to access all of these because it's all there, your teachers have sent them out, but we're going to send it all on one piece of paper so it's easy to find. That's it. Keep reading. Keep reading. See you guys. Bye. So, come with me and have a look at our brand new library. It's nearly finished. Not quite. Come this way. Shh, don't tell Mrs Tierney that we showed you. It's a forest of books reading. Ah. Isn't it amazing?